I'm Denver criminal defense attorney Michael Becker. When people get charged with a crime in Colorado, the judge will order them to stay away from any alleged victims while the case is pending. Here are five things to know about these mandatory protection orders or MPOs. One, courts typically issue MPOs during the arraignment, which is when the defendant is formally charged, and MPOs remain in effect until the case ends. Two, MPOs issued in domestic violence cases often have the strictest requirements, such as not contacting certain relatives, surrendering any guns, and avoiding alcohol. Even sending flowers to the victim would be prohibited under an MPO. Three, the terms of MPOs can be changed. Defendants can always file a motion with a court asking the judge to modify the order, and the judge may hold a hearing to help him or her decide whether to relax the terms. Four, many judges treat MBOs as a condition of bail. If the defendant violates an MPO, the judge could revoke the bond completely and jail the defendant pending the outcome of the case. And five, MPOs are different from civil protection orders. MPOs issue after a person has been accused of a crime. In contrast, victims apply for civil protection orders in an effort to keep someone, such as an angry ex-spouse, from committing a crime in the future. If you're facing criminal charges, we invite you to contact the Colorado Legal Defense Group. My experienced legal team will fight to get your charges reduced or dismissed.